because this weekend is going to be a very, very big one in Durban when the Top Gear Festival makes its way to the Moses Mabita Stadium. But, you know, they, they're deciding to kind of give a bit of Top Gear taste to Ekasi. They're taking yeah. it to Kwama Shubaba. A show and shine competition will be or was held this past weekend. We had our, our cameras there to capture all of the action ahead of the big festival this weekend. Take a look. This year, Durban's Top Gear Festival has some Kasi flavor added to it. In the build-up to the big event, Durban Tourism hosted a popular show-and-shine car show in Kwamashu Township. Top Gear is a global brand. It's a well-recognized brand. It encapsulates all things motoring and attracts every kind of petrol head you could find. The events on the 21st and 22nd of June this year at Moses Mabita Stadium is an all-new stadium show this year. We have a new content manager, Marius Roberts, who's organized brand new content for this year. It's going to be awesome. Ita Greeny speaker Logi Naidu was there to witness the extraordinary event that had offered guests and participants a true taste of township life. For us, it's about putting Durban on the international radar screen. It's about us being an event city, a sports destination. And no wonder we're now in the top 100 cities in the world in terms of eventing. And Top Gear is one of those major events. We have decided that this activation should take place here in Kwamaju. We want to go outside the city centre. We want to be as inclusive as possible. We want to attract new audiences to our shows. And we want all citizens of Etegweni to take ownership of this event. And that's the reason we come out here. But in addition, we are now promoting township tourism. And this is one of the venues that we want to use to promote and bring overseas visitors to have a township experience. Sishanyama, local music, getting down, enjoying the vibe. And that's really the intention here. The event was hosted at the one and only Entertainment Center, a venue that proves that the township has what it takes to draw visitors from afar. I think this not only actually profiles one and only, but actually gives um, shape and form to the township of, of Kwamash. As you know, that this is a township that is known mostly for crime. So really, the, this event is actually changing the landscape of, of the township. Over and above that, it's actually providing uh, local economic development because, as you can see, that there are a lot of, of local entrepreneurs who are actually uh, selling outside and actually created a lot of, of job opportunities. So not only is it benefiting the venue, but also it's really raising a profile of, of the township as well. Drivers of the cars displayed all hope to win a place at the Top Gear Festival. It was up to the public to vote for their favorite souped up set of wheels. It's very good and it's actually developing our area and, and it's the first time and I'm really enjoying it and I'm very grateful that it actually came in my much because it, it was a surprise. I didn't even know about it. Actually my, one of my friends called me so he said I must come here so that's why I came. We've come to display this uh, beautiful 1975 uh, Cheval Camino. It's got original aluminium bullet rims that have been brought in from the States. Shaggy carpeting that's been done. There's a wood grain steering wheel from the States as well. I own a 1972 Chef Forenza Tudo Coupe. It's got a 5.7 litre V8, so it's quite a, quite a hammer. The car has been in my blood from a small boy. It's the second car now that I've done. Quite excited to be here as well today. I'm hoping to get a chance to get into the Top Gear Festival and uh, show the car to the public as well. We love engaging with the local community and showcasing all the cars that KZN has to offer this year. We intended on there being 40 winners for today and 40 cars ended up showing up. So everyone today is a winner and they're all receiving four tickets to the Top Gear Festival. Do you have your tickets? The festival is on from the 21st to the 22nd of June at the Moses Mabita Stadium in Durban.